when you talk about North Carolina State, it starts with the with their quarterback, Jacoby Brissett. I think he's a, a Heisman Trophy candidate. He's a guy that is a, is a dual threat, a big physical runner, can also throw it, was extremely accurate, threw the ball really well, like I said, at the conclusion of last season. You know, we'll scheme him up, and I'm sure they'll scheme us up too. But, you know, we have confidence in what our defensive coaches are telling us to do, and as long as we do what we're coached to do, we should be okay. Coach Brown highlights NC State's success at the end of last season and says his team is ready for the challenge. They did a really good job rushing the football. Uh, they've got one guy that's going to be out, but the guy, the kid Days is, uh, is really impressive. Does a great job on kickoff return, but also very talented. They were one of the most balanced offenses in the country last year. Defensively, uh, statistically, I thought they, they did some really good things last year. Uh, again, played their best at the end of last year, uh, really from uh, the Louisville game on. I thought they were really impressive. But uh, defensive line-wise, they've got a lot of depth. Uh, they're going to run a lot of guys in there. It'll be a challenge for us up front. And then they have one of the, one of the most, if not the most, experienced secondaries in the country. So we've got our hands full. Um, but our kids are looking forward to it. It'll be a great environment to go out there and play on Saturday night. As Coach Brown enters his first game as the Trojans head coach, he looks across the field to NC State head coach Dave Dorn with nothing but respect. Dorn, you know, if you look at his win-loss record and you take out the one his first season at North Carolina State, it's really impressive, as good as anybody in the country. I think you can always judge uh, really good coaches by their win-loss record in close games, and his is extremely high there too. As the countdown to kickoff comes to a close, one senior on the team shares the importance of Saturday's game and the impact it has on the mindset of the team. It's gonna have to be. It's gonna have to be very, very. It's gonna have to be an up tempo game. You know, uh, like I said, it's the first game for them and us. So uh, that first game always shows. I mean, who wants it? You know, you already pumped. Everybody pumped. And so if we if we keep a strong pace throughout the whole game, you know, um, hopefully they get tired. We can just hit them with stuff they're unexpected with.